Hello everyone, it's me, Ben Almaden, and I'm here today on Entertainment Zone for some Saw 8 news. My God, it's been a long, long time since I've done a Saw-related video. Um, obviously, Saw 8 was announced a while ago, and it, for a while it was running with the name Saw Legacy. But obviously, things are now uh, well in motion, um, and I felt... And I thought, you know, it's time to start giving you guys the info. We've gone through a lot of the Saw franchise together, so I'm here to share um, the news on it with you now. So the eighth film is no longer going to be called Saw Legacy. Instead, it's going to be called Jigsaw. Now, the first poster has been released uh, for Jigsaw. You can find it in the link in the description below. Um, in it, you see the infamous pig mask uh, with the words Become Jigsaw. Um, I'm very excited about it. It's a very subtle tease of a poster. Um, and I just, uh, I can't believe that the franchise is finally coming back. Now, we also have a synopsis for the film from Lionsgate. It reads, bodies are turning up around the city, each having met a uniquely gruesome demise. As the investigation proceeds, evidence points to one man, John Kramer. But how can this be? The man known as Jigsaw has been dead for over a decade. So yes, this is hinting that someone else has took over the Jigsaw mantle. Um, we do know that uh, Costas Mandelor, who plays Hoffman, and Carrie Elwes, who played Dr. Gordon, are not returning for the film which indicates that someone new has took over the mantle. But what's interesting will be to find out uh, whether this person has been around for a while and exactly how long were they involved way back in the day? Did they know about uh, Amanda's involvement, Hoffman's involvement, Dr. Gordon's involvement? It raises a lot of questions. Now, we do know Jigsaw himself, Tobin Bell, is coming back for the film. Uh, we don't know in what capacity. Obviously, I think it will be in flashbacks, um, setting up how he knew this old apprentice um, and maybe, you know, reviewing old stock footage of the old films and discussing the Jigsaw case. Uh, so it'll be interesting to see how he ties into that. Um, now, the cast has been announced. We've got Mandela Van Peebles, um, Laura Vandervert, uh, who people will obviously know um, from Smallville, uh, Brittany Allen, Callum Keith Rennie, Matt Passmore, Hannah Emily Anderson, Josiah Black, Shaquan Lewis, Michael Bolsvert, and James Gomez. Now, it'll be interesting to see whether um, any of the other um, characters from previous Saw films do turn up. Um, you know, we had. Um, Matt and Ryan, um, from the opening trap of Saw 3D, that was often debated whether they were the pigmen um, at the end of Saw 3D with Dr. Gordon. Um, are those pigmen part of the new uh, jigsaws in this film? Who knows? Um, I don't believe Tanidra Howard's coming back. Um, I'll certainly ask her, but to my knowledge, I don't think she's come back for the film. So uh, it really will be interesting to find out who is left to take over this mantle. Um, I hope that it doesn't feel forced in. I'm glad the franchise is back. I'm hoping we get good traps, great mythology. I hope it doesn't fall into hostile torch porn territory. I hope that it sticks to the saw formula of um, morality, mortality, um, you know, the mythology of the franchise. Um, I want there to be a great twist, and that's what I'm hoping for. Now, the film is uh, being written by um, Josh Stolberg and Pete Goldfinger, um, the duo behind the Piranha 3D movies, and directing uh, Peter and Michael Spierig, um, who made the films uh, Undead, Daybreakers, and Predestination. Um, I haven't seen those films, I must admit, but I've heard great things about predestination. Um, what does comfort me is that Mark Berg and Oren Kules are returning to produce. Um, as I said, Tobin Bell will be back. Um, and I know he's very passionate about the quality of the franchise. You know, again, I've met Tobin Bell. Um, he's a 
very passionate guy, uh, especially about this franchise, and I know he wouldn't return if he didn't think it was up to scratch. Uh, now, the film is also going to have a presence at San Diego Comic Con, uh, which is coming up uh, very, very soon. Hopefully, uh, we might get a trailer or at least a teaser trailer there. That's what I'm hoping for. Um, all I can say, though, is that I'm really, really thrilled Saw is coming back. I have really high hopes. Um, and soon as we get anything, uh, more posters, uh, promotional images, um, uh, any story beats that aren't too spoilerish, I will be here sharing them with you guys. I never thought I'd be back uh, doing soft videos uh, after all this time, but I'm glad we are. So remember to stick around uh, at Entertainment Zone for all the latest news on Jigsaw um, because you'll hear it here first. Okay, guys. Um, let me know your thoughts about the upcoming film Jigsaw, the eighth entry in the Saw franchise. Are you excited? Are you scared? Do you think it's going to be good? What are your hopes for the movie? Uh, who do you hope to return? Um, what do you think might happen? Let me know in the comments. And don't forget for all the latest film news and reviews, you can subscribe to us here on YouTube. I'm on Twitter at BL Maiden and Entertainment Zone's on Tumblr at entertainmentzone.tumblr.com. Okay guys, so until next time, take care and speak to you soon.